Hey guys, so welcome back to another Motivational Monday. Um, so today I'm going to be talking about all kinds of things that relate to the holidays, such as being thankful, giving, and all that other fun stuff like that. So anyways, let's just hop right into the video. Okay, you guys, so Thanksgiving just ended. I hope everybody had a great Thanksgiving. I had a good Thanksgiving. Um, it was just an amazing day. Um, I hosted, and my family was there, and it was just a wonderful day. Um, we were, like, reminiscing and things like that. But I wanted to talk about Thanksgiving, um, and not really Thanksgiving in per se, but I wanted to talk about being thankful. So... Sometimes it seems, sometimes to me it seems, and I know I'm like this, you know, if you're like this too, I don't blame you because I'm like this. Um, do you guys ever find yourself only being thankful on Thanksgiving? <laughs> like, I know I do it on Thanksgiving. I'll be like, oh, I'm thankful for this food. I'm thankful for my family. I'm thankful for this. I'm thankful for that. And sometimes it's hard to be thankful other than Thanksgiving because you kind of have to be thankful. Um... <laughs> You guys, I really want to persuade you to be thankful every single day. You guys, days are precious, and we need to take them as they come and be thankful for them as they come and view them as they come because every day, every breath, every moment is precious. Um, and I just encourage you so much. There's going to be a lot of encouraging in this video. Just saying. Anyways, I encourage you so much to just take time out of your day, out of your week, to just even one thing, name one thing that you're thankful for. Because I know a lot of times, you know, we just focus on all, all that we're thankful for on Thanksgiving, and that's not good enough. We all should be thankful for everything year round. We should all just take every day as they come and be thankful for something, find something out of the day, even if it's a horrible day. Be thankful that the sun came up because I don't know if you realize it, and yes, everybody has their struggles, and everybody's going through things. I know, I've been through things, and I, I don't know anybody who hasn't, but I just want to tell you that you guys are all blessed. You're blessed. If you're breathing, you're blessed. If you are um, happy, you're blessed. If you have clothes on, you're blessed. If you have family that loves you, you're blessed. Don't forget how blessed you are. I know that sometimes we can get all caught up in the negative side of life and say, oh, you know, my job isn't going so well and my mom is being so mean to me. But you know what? Your mom loves you and be thankful that you have a job. You know, like find the silver lining. And I know I've talked about this before, but this is so, so, so important to me. Um, I just feel like we should all be thankful every day, you guys, because we are so blessed. There's people that are struggling such so much harder than we are. And I know you might be in a super dark place in your life, but I can guarantee you that there's somebody out, out there on this earth that's in a darker and deeper hole than you are. And sorry if you hear these dogs in the background. But yeah, I just, I really want to encourage you to just be blessed, be thankful and for every single day, for every breath you take, because life is precious and you don't know when your last day is going to be. Knock on wood that it's not going to be soon, but you never know. It could be tomorrow. You know, the world could end or, um, you know, a freaking anvil could fall on your head. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But you just never know what's going to happen. You never know. Um, so love yourself and love the people around you. Um, be thankful for the people around you. Even your mom, even though she grounded you and your little brother is being so annoying, be thankful that you have a little brother because some people don't. Some people would kill for a mom and a little brother so you know just find things in your life and be thankful and I promise you that will bring you such joy and such happiness that you can't even fathom right now let me know in the comments one thing that you're thankful for so the next thing that I'm gonna be going on to and this is a really really positive motivational Monday but you know we're we're in the middle of the holiday season and I feel like we're this is just the holiday season is just full and like just filled up with positive vibes and so I am spreading them on to you if you don't have any. Um, <laughs> so anyways, Christmas is right around the corner and um, you guys like I <laughs> just I want I really am going to trust this right now and I know you're going to be like, die heaven, don't preach me, blah blah blah, don't you know. Guys, there's kids in America who don't have things. 
even not even in just in America. There's kids, of course, we know that there's kids all over the world who don't have what they need, especially around Christmas time. And you guys, Christmas can be the best season or the best day of the year. Christmas, you know, whenever you wake up and you there's like all kinds of presents under the tree, there's your stockings full um, and you know things like that. You guys, some people don't have that. Some people don't even have a place to live. And like I said, Christmas can be a great time of the year or it can be a horrible time of the year that brings such um, you know bad memories or whatever. Um, so I'm going to really encourage you to donate. Like I know that you might be saying, Heaven, how are you going to ask me to donate something? I don't even have this and that. But honestly, I feel like if you bless others, you will be blessed and you will feel blessed. Um, and you know, I I just I really firmly and truly believing that believe that if you're ever going to donate, like if you if you're <laughs> get out of here, Dash. If you're ever going to donate, I really encourage you to do it this time of the year because there's families that don't have presents. There's families that don't even have um, jackets or shoes or clean socks or clean blankets or clean or even a hot meal. Um, there's so many ways that you can donate. Not you don't you don't just have to donate money. I know that you know that you see that everywhere. You see the little the Salvation Army guy dinging his little bell at Walmart or Kroger or wherever you're going. But you don't have to do that. There's other ways that you can donate. If you you know don't feel pressure to to donate your money, especially if you don't know where exactly where it's going. Donate clothes. D uh, I know. Trust me. I know. <laughs> that you have something in the back of your closet that you haven't worn in six years. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Maybe not that long, but at least six months. And you're just like, I'm never going to wear this again. I'm never going to wear this sweater because I don't like it. I know that there's somebody out there that can use it. Think about that. Think about even though I might not use it, there's somebody out there in the world who can. And, you know, just do that. Like, take your clothes. Go through your closets, ladies. I know you got some stuff in your closet. I know you got some old jackets and coats in your closet. Even if they might not be in tip-top shape. I mean, I, that's okay. I'm sure just pe some people are willing to have anything. You guys, I just really am going to encourage you to donate clothes. The next thing that you can donate is, and I'm not saying, guys, go donate to the blah, 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 blah. I'm saying go donate. Go be a part of the community. Go help somebody, especially around Christmas time. Spread joy because that is what Christmas is all about. It's about giving and it's about love and peace and joy. So, you know, um, donate some of your clothes. The next thing that you can do is if you got any extra canned food, just go and bring it to a food bank or bring it to the Salvation Army. The Salvation Army, um, like I said, I'm not trying to tell you where to donate, but the Salvation Army does free meals, especially on, like they do a free meal every night for people, every single night. So if you don't, if you can't get a free meal, you can go over to the Salvation Army, and also they do free meals on Christmas time, and they also do free meals after church on Sundays. Um, and you don't like, you know, if that's not your thing, whatever. But um, so you know, if you can, you can either uh, give some uh, like an extra turkey or some canned goods um, over to them if you wanted to do that. Or the last thing is, is you could actually give your time. Um, and donate, uh, or not, you could give your time and you could go and um, help uh, volunteer at the Salvation Army or volunteer just anywhere. You could volunteer anywhere. Um, you guys, I really, I really am going to encourage you to do this. I mean, donating is just a beautiful thing. If you're helping somebody and you know that you're helping somebody and you will feel such joy in your heart and you will feel su such blessings and uh, happiness around this time of year because this is what it's all about you know we have to look out for each other I know I'm not like looking exactly at the camera but we have to we have to look out for each other you guys you know there's people that struggle and they didn't even do anything to get there they just you know something happened um, and you know you just we got to help each other out you guys we got to help each other out we got to pay it for it if you will <laughs> so anyways you guys I'm sorry that was like a huge little you know, big old thing, and I, I know some of you aren't gonna like it. You're not gonna appreciate it. You're gonna be like, "Heaven is just preaching to me. She's telling me to be thankful, and I ain't got nothing to be thankful for." And she's telling me to donate, and I ain't even got no clothes. <laughs> I got my clothes from Goodwill. No, I'm just kidding. But I, I really am. 
I'm telling you guys, you will feel such joy in your hearts. You'll feel such love in, in your heart and such love in your family and your home because you'll feel so good about what you've done and you'll feel good like you'll just feel good i can't even say it enough you guys but thank you so much for watching this video if you made it all the way through thank you so much make sure to leave a comment down below and let me know what you're thankful for and um yeah that's about it make sure to subscribe if you like my channel um i do motivational mondays like this and i do lifestyle things i do recipes i do um you know just random stuff that you see on everybody else's channel <laughs> um but anyways guys thank you so much for watching and uh subscribing and all that other stuff thank you again and i love you stay beautiful